powerful breakthroughs, so aware, wounds healed, um, money release, and six dollars pay increase. Quite well. I wanted to post some very powerful testimonies from some of the mentees. Okay, so here's the first one. It says, another testimony um, at my new job that I'm starting, I was told that my pay was X amount and I didn't really like the pay because I was being greedy. It was enough to cover my living expenses, but I wanted more. Prior to my interview, I asked Apostle Genesis to pray for me and God told uh, her to tell me not to be greedy. And I would get an increase. Long story short, I was called into the office to finish my paperwork. And HR told me I was actually getting paid $6 more an hour. I was in the office filling out paperwork like, wow, look at God. So this is a pretty, it's not pretty long, but I'm just going to start where um, it says, well, yesterday. Um, and this is because she recently just lost her mom. And um, I suggested to her that she needs to do some grief counseling. So we're going to start there. So it said, well, yesterday I finally took that step and got the information for counseling and had a conversation with the only person I talked to and told them that I had to give up my phone for the month of March. No phone conversations outside of my job. That conversation really didn't go well. It was a struggle for two weeks. I've been back with supplemental um, health about my information being mixed up and they told me I needed to wait a total of seven to ten days yesterday after I did what Apostle said because I told them that for the month of March they are to sacrifice something that is a very is of great importance to them okay so in any event she did that so she said yesterday after I deal with Apostle said god told me to do it as soon as i hung up the phone telling him i had to give up my phone um she got a call and an eight thousand dollar check was released to her now this is a very powerful testimony i want to say a couple of days ago i told her to meditate on ephesians 5 and 11 in the english standard version and i told her um that there were things that god wanted to reveal to her concerning her husband she did that all right, and then God gave her the revelation. Now she didn't get offended, um, but she got a lot of instructions and rebukes herself from God. She said, I love this ministry. God is really helping my marriage. Check this out. For the liars who say I'm an advocate for a divorce. I've been getting rebuked all morning by God. God told me I wanted um, you and your husband to be together. He might not come packaged the way you like, but the devil in hell will not be able to separate y'all. I started y'all together for a reason. Well, I got home um, so we could have a day date, and I got a vision of my husband, and I hold in hands. Our hearts were out of our chest, but connected as one flesh with wires. Behind us was a tall, high-ranking demon, and behind the demon was me, getting to know him. In a white robe and thousands of angels getting to know him, pulled out a sword, sword of the spirit, which is the word of God, and chopped that demon's head off, and he fell to the ground. Another powerful testimony. Hey, Apostle, I have a testimony. Ever since I was about 18 years old, I've been having extremely long menstrual episodes. Every time I had my time of the month, I would be on for less, for no more than, I'm sorry, for no less than three months. Sorry about that. At a time when huge clots and I would have to get blood transfusions and iron transfusions. Last Friday, the day before you prayed over our wounds. So I actually prayed for the wounds of many of the people in the ministry i also pray for the men because there was a there's a couple in there they're no longer in there um and she is a marine she belongs to the marine kingdom and so she has done so much witchcraft to her husband they actually got together by way of her doing a love spell all right but when i prayed for him he talked about how he was very restricted down there and that um he felt a release Let's keep going. I had my menstrual. I'm sorry, TMI. That Saturday you prayed over us. I felt an extreme amount of heat in my pelvis area. The entire prayer. Well, my testimony is this: the first menstrual strike, uh, the the first menstrual cycle in 13 years that I've had for only five normal days with no clots. 
So she was healed that day, along with many others. I just have not gotten around to posting their testimonies. But that was such a powerful prayer that morning. I love to post these testimonies. I love to make a mockery out of people who have disrespected my ministry, who call me fraud, who say all of these lies and outlandish things concerning me. This is what my ministry stands on. 1 Corinthians 4 verse 20. For the kingdom of God is not just a lot of talk. It is living by God's power. And that is exactly what this ministry displays.